I'm sitting here with our National VA Youth Chairperson, Mbali Ntuli, um, and she is in Cape Town for the day visiting a whole bunch of youth development projects in the city. Um, maybe Mbali, do you want to tell us a bit about your day, what you're doing here in Cape Town, and, and what your experience would be like? Sure. Um, the youth leader, Makashire Ghana, and I have been visiting all DA run municipalities just to basically highlight how DA run municipalities are really um, making sure that they take youth upliftment and youth initiatives that help young people in their municipalities very seriously. So today I visited three different um, organizations where we saw how pioneering some of the um, youth organizations are, um, primarily because of the support that they received from the from the Democratic Party. you want to tell us a bit about the three projects you visited? What kind of issues did they deal with? Sure. Well, in the morning I visited um, an outpatient drug rehabilitation centre in Delft, um, in Cape Town. And basically this is a centre that helps young people who have obviously substance abuse programs um, through a very um, pioneering matrix system of making sure that young people um, receive the sort of help that they need but while still being in their community so that it helps their process of rehabilitation and not just sort of taking them out and isolating them. The second project that we visited was the Nyanga Job Centre and um, basically this is a skills upliftment program where the city of Cape Town has afforded young entrepreneurs um, skills programs to help them in terms of making their own sort of um, jobs and creating their own sort of income um, as well as allowing them the space to do so. And it's a variety of different programs that they can sort of learn skills from, um, sort of going from welding to upholstery to mechanical sort of um, automobile repairs to uh, catering and a, a variety of different initiatives that cater for whatever young people in that community feel that they really need. And then the third program um, or project that we went to was Christmas Academy, which is so incredibly exciting because it's the first of its kind in South Africa um, and it's receiving an enormous amount of support from the administration. Four of our ABC is actually still on the board of the academy um, and make sure that the academy has everything that it needs to run. And the academy is basically focused on taking young, um, the, the youth that are at risk and making sure that they go through some sort of life skills program um, and development um, in order to help them really be able to tackle the problems that face them. Cool. So all in all, what would you say about you know, about the DA's commitment to dealing with young people's problems? And I would think that there's no party in South Africa that is currently so focused on making sure that young people in South Africa are given the enormous amounts of opportunities that they can take to better their lives. I think that these three programs specifically have shown real commitment from the democratic lines. Um, and it's really exciting because all three of them are very pioneering. They're the first of their kind in the whole of our country. And I think it says a lot about the DA's commitment to young people. Cool, thanks in Bali. Sure.